Bows and arrows have been requested since the early days of overgrowth development. This feature becomes a reality with the bow and arrow mod by Girth. It includes a bow, a quiver, and a wide range of arrow types. There are flashbang arrows, poison cloud arrows, poison arrows, smoke arrows, impact explosion arrows, timed explosion arrows, and of course, good old killing arrows. Arrows can be fired in two different ways. The first uses an automatic aim that targets the nearest enemy, and the second allows you to aim manually. To use the mod once you've installed and activated it, start a level and press escape. If you then just see the pause menu, you need to press F1 to enable the editor. Now go to Load, Bow and Arrow, and spawn the objects in the level by clicking on them and then clicking where you want to spawn them. Copy and paste with Ctrl C and Ctrl V to quickly make lots of arrows. Attach the bow to your character's left hand by selecting it, holding Alt and clicking the hand. If you attach the bow to the other hand, you won't be able to use it. You could attach the arrows too, but doing that can cause some bugs, so I recommend picking them up using Q each time you restart the level, which you can do by pressing L. Skip cutscenes by pressing Enter. To put away the arrow in your hand, press E. It looks like there are only two arrows, but they're all there. You can have up to six arrows on your back. To take an arrow from your back, press E. Delete any other attached objects such as knives, otherwise you'll take that out instead of an arrow. With an arrow out, press or hold Q to fire it. Pressing the button will use the automatic aiming, while holding it uses the manual aiming. If you find it hard to aim, you can make it easier by turning down your mouse sensitivity. Press Escape, Settings, Input and turn it down. I have mine set to 2%. You might have noticed that we're not using the quiver. That's because the quiver in this mod is just for looks. Spawn it, select it, and hold Alt while clicking in one of the circles on your character's tail to attach it. You can make the camera follow the arrow when you shoot it by pressing Tab. This both turns on slow motion and the follow camera for arrows. To get the mod, click Mods on the main menu. Then get more mods. Search for bow and arrow mod, click it, and then subscribe. Now close the overlay and wait for the mod to download. Close and reopen the mod menu to make the mod show up, so you can make sure it's active before you start playing. And while you're in the workshop, don't forget to check out some of the other mods made by the awesome people in the Wolffire community.